NAT has declared a shortage of teachers in West Pokot County, a crisis which has contributed to low performance of students in the region. Now, speaking in Kapinguria, NAT Secretary Martin Sembelo stated that West Pokot is a marginalized county with, with a shortage of more than 2,000 teachers in both primary and secondary schools. Father called for transparency in the recruitment of new teachers. We want to appeal to the Teacher Service Commission that West Pokot is a marginalized area. We have a shortage of teachers of more than 2,000 teachers, both primary and secondary. The coming recruitment, you were very much transparent in West Pokot. Yeah, Ogetoa mutu mwenye ajawai sikia bunduki, ajawai sikia mlio ya kitu yochoto ubelege jese kun, atawaja kasi. So tuangalia wale wametoka kule, ili wanajua shida ya kwao. Naomba, serekale wajiri watoto sana kutoka sehemu hizo. Ili, hao watu wapate elimu ya kutosha kama sehemu zingine katika nchi hii. Now, previously in the JSS story, Kakamega County Governor Fernandez Barraza has called upon the Teachers Service Commission to reinstate the jobs of all the junior secondary school teachers who have been laid off because of the involvement in the recent strike. Now, while speaking at the Kenya National Teachers Union NAT annual general meeting in Mumias, the governor demanded for the commission to revoke their decision and give the teachers permanent jobs and pensionable jobs. Unfortunately, Yakwamba TSC decided to indemnify the Walimuetu at JSS. Na sisi kama viongozi ambao tunapenda masomo. And on behalf of my colleagues in the Council of Governors, I want to demand the reinstatement of our 755 JSS teachers. And to go further, we shall also be demanding that these JSS teachers are employed on permanent and penetrable terms. Because when you look at the infrastructure, Walimuetu, Shulezetu Nyingi Sana, they don't have the infrastructure. And these GSS teachers are doing a lot of work. And that is why Tasisi Hapachini, we shall support where we can. But in terms of the welfare of our GSS teachers, our irreducible minimum for them to be reinstated and then they must also employ them on permanent and punishable. Deputy President Shigadi Gashi.